Hey everybody. Hey, I got the bad news today. Uh, my channel is being demonetized for lack of 1,000 subscribers and lack of 4,000 hours of watch time in the past 12 months. I'm not happy about it. Why are they doing this? Well, they say it, and quote, it is to prevent bad actors from harming the inspiring and original creators around the world who make their living on YouTube. To me, that sounds like YouTube is putting their protective arms around the big creators and just shutting the door on the rest of us. Well, not everybody makes their living on YouTube, but still have expenses in the cost of making their videos. And my, you know, few hundred dollars that I make on ad revenue isn't a whole lot, but it helps. It helps offset the cost of the camera that I bought, the computer that I upgraded to, the software that I purchased, mostly all to make videos. Myself, I have never had a community strike against me. I don't spam. I don't uh, have misleading thumbnails or misleading titles. I don't do sub for sub or any nonsense like that. I don't know what to do now. You know, what, where do I go from here? Do I just give up, throw in the towel and say, screw it, I'm done? Or do I put my head down, drive forward, keep plugging away, making videos, and someday, you know, hopefully reach that plateau that they're looking for? I mean, after all, I have already purchased the equipment. I might as well get my use out of it. You know, to me, I, I purchased that equipment as an investment, figuring I would get that money back someday. I'm not looking to make a full-time living on YouTube. Not everybody is. It'd be nice to have a part-time income to help out with the, you know, the expenses of the projects that I make and stuff like that. You know, I, I just think, be fair. If, if, a, if a channel is spamming and stealing and whatever else that they're worried about, then go after those channels. Leave my channel be. A channel like mine, it, it takes time to make a video. You know, a lot of my videos are how-to videos on projects that I've made in my shop. That's, you know, that might take a week to make my project and I'm filming along the way. Then I have, you know, hours of footage I have to cut down to four or five minutes. I can't just make four or five videos a week like YouTube wants. You know, other videos that I make are seasonal. You know, they're about homesteading and, you know, the garden and chickens and, you know, it's the middle of winter right now. I can't make videos on that. I don't know what to do. What are you guys going to do? You know, if you're in the same boat as me, what's your plans? Let's hear about it in the comments. Um, let's keep the conversation going. See what we can do to, to help each other out. Although, sub for sub is not going to work, guys. I, it's, that's the first thing I started seeing today is sub for sub, let's get over the 1,000 subscriber mark. Well, it's more than just that. you got to have the watch time. you got to have the viewer engagement. So, I ask if you would go look at my channel, see if you like my videos, and subscribe if you do. I will try and do some more of that myself in the upcoming weeks here. I'm going to try and find small channels that I enjoy and I'm going to subscribe to them and I'm going to watch their videos. Anyway, thanks for listening to me rant and uh, thanks for watching the video. And please go check out my channel, look at my videos, watch a couple. If you like them, subscribe to me. That's all I ask. Thanks again.